I know what you're thinking. <laughs> that I've uh, finally lost it. <laughs> but I haven't. I want you to know that I really appreciate all of our sessions that we've had for the last five years, every two weeks. It's not that therapy didn't work, but I have come to an important conclusion on my own. I want to be a dog. Or at least be like a dog. Now, this doesn't mean that I'm going to be like barking at parked cars or hiding under the bed when I hear thunder or uh, begging Terry for a steak every night. Well, maybe not the first two. You see, Bambi and I were on a walk a few days ago when I had an epiphany. As you know, she's over 16 years old now. But she still gets excited and jumps around like crazy when I show her that leash. <laughs> Just like when she was a puppy. She doesn't mind that she only goes a couple of houses away instead of a mile like years ago. No matter what, she just struts along and sniffs the hedges and does her dog things like it was the first time out of the house for her. Then I noticed that when she gets a special dinner, like some ground beef or something like that, she doesn't consider that it's harder for her to chew or wonder what's for dinner tomorrow. She just savors every bite. And when she lays down on the bed at night, she gives us hugs and kisses, just like she did on the first night that she was with us. When she closes her eyes, I know she doesn't dwell on the fact that sooner rather than later, she won't be with us anymore. On balance, <laughs> she's lived a long, happy life, and as far as I can tell, she's done it by living it, living in the now and not worrying about the future or regretting the past. And that's what I need to do. Just be present in the moment and uh, do my dog things. <laughs>